So Android is set up in a way that prevents applications from accessing other information on your device. This is done by the use of the permissions API, meaning that if you download an application, say a basic flashlight application, then it doesn't need any permission on your phone just to turn the flashlight on and off. However, a lot of these applications want to make additional revenue from people thanks to their location data. So a lot of these sketchy applications will request for location data or access to your phone, access to your contact list, a lot, a lot of, of different, different other permissions that you might not be aware of at first. So today I want to show, show you how, how to, to control the application permissions on the Galaxy S9 and the Galaxy S9 Plus. So we're going to do this. We're going to start by opening up the settings application. Then we're going to tap on the apps option. And we have two different ways to do this here. We can first browse through our applications or we can actually tap on the three dot menu and just look at the app permissions. So first let me show you how to do it via the apps way. So say we are going through here and pick on, all right, the Google Drive. We know Google Drive needs access to things like the storage. Uh, if you want to use the camera to capture something, it'll need access to the camera. But um, again, ima we're just imagining that this is, say, a flashlight application, a weather application. There's no need for a weather application to have access to your storage or your camera unless there's a, an actual reason for that to happen. So we're just going to tap on Google Drive or your weather app or your flashlight app, whatever it is. And we're going to scroll down a bit and look for the permissions option. Tap on that. Now we're going to get a list of all of the permissions that this application is programmed to use. And then we're going to see which ones are enabled and which ones are denied. So again, you know, we need Google Drive to access our storage if we want to save something to it. So we have the storage permission enabled, makes sense. I don't have a reason to, for Google Drive to have access to my camera. So I'm just gonna go ahead and disable that. And now anytime I open up that application, it will not have access to my camera. Simple as that. Now, as I mentioned, we can go back Another way to go through and control your application permissions is by tapping on this three dot menu up at the top and then tap on the app permissions option. What this is going to do is this is going to list all of the programmed permissions that we have on the Galaxy S9 and the Galaxy S9 Plus. And it's going to show us how many applications can, the second number is how many applications can access is programmed to access that permission. The first number is actually how many applications have been granted that permission to know that information. So again, just for the body sensors, we wanna know what applications are using the body sensors. We just tap on it. We can see that Google Play Services is knowing the body sensors if we want. We can just turn it off. This is some of the features of Google Play Services may not work with body sensors not working. If you're okay with that, just kept on deny anyway. As simple as that. I'll go through and show you another one. The phone option. So we have stuff like Bixby Home, BX Actions, Calendar, Contacts, Facebook, Galaxy Apps. I have no idea why Galaxy Apps would need my phone. So I'm just gonna go ahead and tap on that. Tap on deny. And now Galaxy Apps does not have access to my phone. And there you have it. That is how to control the application permissions on the Galaxy S9 and the Galaxy S9 Plus.